this video, we'll solve the equation 5 6 z minus 7 twelfths equals 2 thirds. I have a lot of people that get worried about problems such as this because of all of the fractions. In our very first step, we're going to get rid of that fraction. So the, I want you to ask yourself, if I were going to make a common denominator, which is kind of a thing we do with fractions, what would that common denominator be? Well, you see that 12 here is the biggest of all of the denominators, and 6 will go into 12 as well as 3 will go into 12. So I'm going to use 12 as my common denominator. The way I use it is I multiply every single fraction in this problem, every single term in this problem by 12. You can even use your calculator to multiply these numbers by 12. Just leave the variable off and you can type it in. When we do that, I want you to notice that all of the fractions go away. That's really the goal there, was to get rid of all those fractions so that we have a nicer problem to deal with. Next, let's do the opposite of subtracting 7, which is to add 7 to both sides. And then I'm going to do the opposite of multiplying by 10, which would be to divide by 10. We get that z is 1.5. Really use this strategy of multiplying by that would-be common denominator so that you can get rid of the fractions in your problems and make it a lot simpler. 